Welcome back. Our Sports Zone Player of the Week had an impressive game this past Friday, scoring a trio of touchdowns in Galen Catholic's win over Tri Center, the first round of the Class A playoffs, helping spark momentum for the Jays as they continue their title quest. Our Sports Zone Week 9 Player of the Week is Galen Catholic wide receiver and defensive back Keaton Bonderson. In the Jays' first round playoff win over Tri Center, the senior reeled in three touchdown passes for 90 yards in the 40-22 victory over the Trojans. Bonderson has been a key player in the team's success. The senior has totaled 44 catches for 656 yards and 11 receiving touchdowns, with his receiving TD total being the third highest in all of Class A, which he credits to the work he's put in to improve, as well as his teammates around him, all while shifting his focus to becoming a better leader for the Jays. I think I matured and I came in with a different mentality of, you know, I got to be a leader and not so much as a follower and get the guys kind of focused in, especially every week on Friday as we get closer to each game. Not only does Bonderson make his presence felt on offense, the senior is statistically one of the better defensive backs in the state. Bonderson is tied for the state lead in interceptions with eight, including one pick six. Similarly, he is among Galen Catholic's top three tacklers. Additionally, he's on the J special teams, serving as the team's punter while also on the return team, where he scored on a pair of kick returns as well as a punt return for a touchdown. Bonnerson's versatility has helped Galen Catholic get to this point, and it's certainly an aspect of his game that his team values. I mean, it's, all, it's really good. I mean, He's bounced out of situations. I mean, like a hit in that one punt return, and I mean, he had, what, three touchdowns? That was awesome. So, I mean, it's just really good to have a player on that team when that makes big plays. 8 and 1 Galen Catholic has recorded its most wins in a season since 2017, and the team has been among one of the best in all of Class A, receiving votes in the weekly poll. This year's Galen Catholic squad has achieved a lot this season as well, highlighted by the Jays hosting their first playoff game since 2011 with head coach Jeremy Schindler crediting the team's success to their senior leadership's chemistry, which he feels has positively impacted the rest of the team. The, the biggest thing with this group is, is we have a group of seniors that really gets along. They're buddies on and off the, the field, and that's trickled down into the underclassmen. These guys really care about each other as people um, you know, and players as well. And so when, you know, when times are getting tough in a football game, they really stick together. And, and that's been the difference in a few games for us this year. 